Good day everyone. Today we're going to be making this table in Tinkercad. Unlike other 3D design software, Tinkercad doesn't really use the extrude tool. Instead, it uses the concept of handles, which you'll see very soon. So let's begin. We're going to take advantage of the work plane and the grid that is in the work plane. We're going to zoom in and we're going to use four of these larger squares that you see in the work plane here. We're going to take a box and place it inside those four squares. Now we're going to be creating the legs first for our table. Here's the handle. When you click, when you put your cursor above this white dot here, that's a handle, these numbers appear. It's telling you the size of the bottom part of this box. Now we're making a leg so we're going to click that and pull it in to 5 by 5. Okay. The leg is already highlighted so I'm going to edit and duplicate it. When I duplicate it, it creates another leg perfectly right on top of the first one. So all I got to do is click it and pull it over. And I'm going to stay still within those four boxes. Now I have two of the legs done. I'm going to highlight both legs now by holding the shift key and clicking the, uh, the first leg. And you can see that both are highlighted. I'm going to rotate this slightly and I'm going to duplicate it again. So edit, duplicate. And once again I'm going to hold down one of the legs and pull them both over. And once again I'm going to stay within those four boxes that I told you before. We can center this by rotating back. Now we're going to make the tabletop. We take another box, we put it right on top of those four legs. and They should fit perfectly. And you can check by rotating right and then back left. Now Here's another handle. We take this white handle here and it tells you it's 20 millimeters high. We pull it down to, let's say, make a table top thickness of four. And there you have your table. Now to have a better look at this, let's zoom out a little bit. We highlight everything. We want to group all the legs with the tabletop. We take this arrow and we rotate it 180 degrees. Click outside. You can zoom around. And there you have your table.